Hey y'all and welcome back to the party. It's your girl Britt Reacts and today we are reacting to Trump Won't Like This from Gabriel Iglesias. Let's see what he has to say. Oh man, this country you guys, I love living here in the United States. I can't think of anywhere else I'd want to live. Some people say, well you're Mexican, wouldn't you rather live in Mexico? Uh... <laughs> I love Mexico. Uh, uh, just visiting. Just visiting. <laughs> Man, I like it right here. That's why it kind of bothers me whenever people go, you know, what is it like being a Latino comedian? I go, I don't know. I'm a comedian who happens to be Latino. What's the difference? The difference is my special will air on Comedy Central, not Telemundo. <laughs> Straight out of the gate. Straight out of the gate. Um, I love this man. He's so funny. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. It's hard, you guys. You know, Espanol. If you speak a little Spanish, it freaks people out. Oh my God, he's speaking Spanish. You know, don't get me wrong. I like watching Spanish programming myself. Some of the stuff is really cool. My favorite thing are the commercials. Come on, come on. Because they're always about sex. You don't even know what the product is until like the last two seconds. It's always some model walking out all sexy, right? Hola. Ay, que rico. <laughs> and on the 28th second, right? Is that true? I've never watched Telemundo. Is that true? Is that true? You know my favorite thing about Gabriel is his, um, like his impressions inside of his his bits, like how he sounds like the lady and it sounds so different from him. Like he creates the characters right there on stage and the sound effects. I love it. I love it. Also, I, I do love Mexico. I love going to Mexico. Mexico is like one of my favorite places to visit. <laughs> sitting there going, I gotta go get a Pepsi. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I have a thing for soda. I love it, man. I know they gave me water, but, oh, a soda. Oh. I didn't even see that right there. Excuse me, un momento. Pepsi. <laughs> uh, no, that's actually diet, which is cool. I cannot stand the taste of diet soda, any kind of diet soda. The aftertaste is awful. Look, zero, Coke Zero, all that stuff. Like, mm -mm, mm -mm. give me the goods. Give me the loaded goods. I'm not on a diet, and it's funny because people go, well, then why do you drink diet soda? <laughs> so I can eat regular cake. <laughs> I love cake, man. Are you kidding? <laughs> By the way, I want to thank the three people who brought me a cake personally. I have them in the back. I really appreciate it. That was very nice of you. The management and the promoters are freaking out. They're like, Gabriel, why do they all bring you cake? I go, because on TV, I talked about one time how much I love cake. And so people bring it. My friend Mando got mad. He's like, why don't you talk about hookers? <laughs> but yeah, somebody asked me earlier, too. They said, Gabriel, when you, when you get to do your special, are you going to do anything about the country? Are you going to talk about politics? Well, I'm going to talk about, first of all, how I love this country and I wouldn't want to live anywhere else. I know that half the world right now thinks that our leader is the devil. And most of us would agree. Yeah. He's not bad. president he does it by himself okay? he does it um i don't know where he's about to go with this but i i'm sure it won't be as politically charged as because he's just really funny he's really good at staying away from that so i'm excited to see where this goes and still i hate diet pepsi anything diet anything and also i'm not a big fan of cake just a fun fact about me, I'm not even into pastries, donuts, cakes, and all that stuff. I like the frosting, but not the cake. Every time he comes on TV, I can't wait to hear what he has to say. Especially during press conferences, right? Mr. President, question. It's been over a year. What is your plan for Katrina? <laughs> we're gonna find her. That's right. And we're gonna bring Katrina to justice. We have every reason to believe Katrina is connected to Al-Qaeda. Al-Qaeda 
and Katrina. They both start with a K. Our president got elected. I didn't vote for him, but then again, I didn't vote for the other guy. Wait, so is this, this says Trump on like this, but that sounded like George Bush and Katrina happened during George Bush's, um, I'm confused. <laughs> I'm confused. I was just like, uh, how Bush won is beyond me. Okay, Americans, we, we love to vote, but we don't vote What's for presidents. We vote for things like American Idol. <laughs> <laughs> because that's fun. Voting for presidents is not fun. Voting for American, she bang, she bang. <laughs> That's what they should do for presidents, you know, just put both guys on TV for one hour, call it something catchy like, who's gonna run this <laughs> Seriously though, pe more people do vote for like shows like American Idol than people that go out to the polls. That's crazy. That's crazy. You put them on TV for an hour, let them argue 30 minutes into the special, you put an 800 number on the screen and say, cast your vote, right? Oh, I would love to cast You've my vote over the presidential phone. hotline. For George Bush, press three. John Kerry, press four. Other options, press five. You don't like either one? Press five. Please hold. <laughs> I love his voices. <laughs> I knew you'd be back. <sighs> Y'all, why does that say Trump won't like this? That had nothing to do with Trump. That had nothing to do with Trump. I don't understand. If, if I miss something, please, please let me know in the comments. All right, well, I loved it. It was funny. Go have the day you deserve. Peace.